strange to us to make such a fuss about something. I remember a c- time didn't. when you were Taoiseach that you went away on holiday uh, immediately after Christmas and it snowed very heavily and you let Michael O'Leary in charge. You've astonished us. No, no. I, <laughs> I, I, I had, it took 24 hours to get a plane to get back and I had to get to Shannon. You and didn't then, have an executive jet? In no, of course not. Oh, dear. Uh, but an, an army plane did bring me uh, from Toulouse where I managed to get to it from Tenerife uh, to Shannon and I flew up, up to Dublin and my main concern was that you had nobody would see me arriving. Time, so we, we had to, yeah. <laughs> no planes get to Dublin. The helicopter sorry, to yeah, Dublin sorry. and I made, not, nobody would see me arriving, you see. Didn't great publicity. And of course every cameraman was out of Vincent's hospital and all I could do was turn my portable typewriter outwards. You'd think I'd been working on affairs of state. I'd actually been working on a study of the decline of the Irish language. What were you doing in Vincent's hospital? Seventy seventy eight. No, no, that's, <laughs> that's <laughs> where the pla- <laughs> that's where the helicopters landed. Oh, those sorry, days. sorry, sorry. Yes. But I did, and I rang Michael, and uh, I told him the whole country's blocked, nothing happening. And I said, "Well, what are you doing about it?" Well, nothing. So where are you? He's in bed. I said, "Well, get up." <laughs> well, so he went in. And I told him, get he was in bed. <laughs> and he has dined out all these years, 22 years, so he's dined out on how he was at the control no, he was. Yeah, <laughs> the desk of the, he uh, went of in, the nation. He and fell on the way into government buildings. And, and <laughs> he fell. The, like, I think. And the, no, no civil servant would go in. They all said they either couldn't get in or they were just running the country from home. Except for, David, um, for, for, for Michael Lillis, who was our diplomatic correspondent. And he and David ran the country very successfully. He and Michael ran the country Michael, very successfully. Yeah, yeah. Um, oh, why didn't you leave the matter, by the way, if they were running the country very successfully? <laughs> well, I thought I should come home. The only thing that happened to me was that I, on the beach in Tenerife, I did see a camera with a long lens, and I thought, some pretty girls on the beach, obviously. So I came home, the photographs of me getting out of the sea in Tenerife, which was not helpful. Government fell three weeks later. There were other reasons for that. <laughs> <laughs> the children's shoes. You, you say you're, you're out measuring children's shoes in Tenerife. Don't start. <laughs>